The ruling and main opposition parties here in Korea are still strangling over the parliamentary probe into the spy agency's alleged involvement in last year's presidential election. The investigation suffered another setback on this Monday when a hearing by spy agency officials was canceled following an ongoing argument about whether or not it should be made public. Our Kim Young Gil has the details. The investigation into the spy agency scandal seems to be going nowhere and is slated to finish in less than two weeks. The spy agency chief and other agency officials were scheduled to appear for questioning before the parliamentary committee overseeing the probe on Monday, but the main opposition Democratic Party refused to attend. The party is boycotting the hearing because it believes that it should be made public via broadcast on the nation's three major networks. The Henry Party disagrees. Another point of contention between the two parties is the witness list. The two parties are at odds over how to ensure that key figures in the investigation, especially former spy agency chief Won Sehun and former Seoul police chief Kim Yong-pan, will appear for questioning. The Democratic Party wants a guarantee that they'll testify, but the Henry Party does not. Rival party leaders met again to discuss the issue on Sunday, but no major breakthroughs were made. We will try to confirm the rest of the witnesses on the list during the hearing on Monday, and the lawmakers on the committee will continue to negotiate on the issue. The people want the nation's spy agency to be reformed. We ask for full cooperation with the special parliamentary investigation into the scandal. Meanwhile, both parties have made proposals for talks with President Park Geun-hye to bring a halt to the political deadlock. Hwang Woo-yeol, the chairman of the ruling Henry Party, made his proposal on Monday. The main opposition Democratic Party made its proposal Saturday. The president hasn't yet responded to either proposal. The parliamentary committee must confirm the witness list by Monday in order to finish the investigation by the self-imposed deadline of August 15. Kim Young-gil, Arirang News.